welcome back guys it's solutiola daniel and today i want to show you how you can password protect your web page your web page your web pages now somebody might be wondering why do i need this maybe it's because i'm a digital creator so um i there is every need for me to protect some of my content especially my courses so you might actually not be a digital um, content creator before you need to um, probably protect one of your website pages now i can now conclude that if you are a digital content creator or digital course creator there is every need for you to protect your courses you understand now let's now say you are not even a digital course creator or a digital content creator let's say you are just um a blogger or whatsoever and you have this kind of content online that you want to protect you understand so there's need for you to protect that particular page where you have the content so now this is exactly what i want to show you how to protect that particular page and the things you need to install on your website to make this objective achievable now the first thing you want to do is you go to go to plugins we'll be doing this using a plugin go to plugin go to um hard new so you'll be adding a plugin called password protect by wp for short it is called PPWP PPWP let's see as you can see I already have it on my own website I have it installed and activated now go ahead install it and activate it so once you are done activating you want to go to that particular page you want to protect so click on go to pages click on you can click on pages or all pages now that page you want to protect you you click on it as you can see now immediately you install the plugin you should see something like this additional tab showing you unprotected 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 so go to the particular page that you want to protect then click on edit like this let me open in a new tab So once it's downloading you want to scroll down now you know which page you want to protect in your own case so you know which page you are planning to protect now let's say you've opened the page like this now you come to the right hand side of your screen you should see this new um, tab included showing password protect wordpress the next thing you want to do is click on this edit like this leave it as global just leave it as global now type in the password you like to use let me say okay test page let me say test page one two three okay that is it so click on submit like this in fact i'm even supposed to show you guys this particular page before i protect it okay let's say you want to remove the password just align the password like this delete it submit as you can see pp light great you've updated the password successfully now let me open this page so you can see the content of the page i don't really have much on the page it's just the page i'm planning to work on as you can see we have welcome here now let me impute the password let me say test page one two three this is the password so let's say for instance you are trying to protect um a particular content and you you want that particular content to be um accessed by particular people you understand let's say let me even use the scenario of um you are trying to protect a course a course page you understand so and you'd 
definitely want to give access to your students so you can go ahead to give them the um, course page link and give them the password so once they're able to um, you um, enter the course page link into their web browser URL, URL bar and they land on the page they won't be able to access that content on the until they impute the password you gave to them now this is the example here this is the page here now i want to password protect the um page now this is the password now click on submit that is not the end come here click on updates it's just a simple process just follow through so make sure you follow through okay let's go back to the page this is the page here this is the page this is the content of the page welcome I'm not done building the page so let's say let me refresh now it should pop up the password stuff this is it guys as you can see now nobody will be able to gain access into that particular page of your website except you've given them the password now what is the password let me type in the password here test page one two three then click on enter let's see how it goes as you can see it guys can you see so this is the simple way to protect your website page a particular page probably a page you have a content you want to protect on so this is just a simple way to do it it's no stress nothing nothing just follow the steps i have laid out how i did mine from um installing and activating the plugin to protecting a particular page to testing it and making sure the password is effective on that page so guys i'll be coming to the end of this particular video i remain on daniel make sure you have a great time